This video featuring Jackson Mahomes, the brother of Kansas City Chiefs quarterback Patrick Mahomes, shows him on security footage grabbing the neck of and fiercely kissing the owner of the establishment whose name is Aspen Vaughn. Mahomes, standing at six foot six, towers over Vaughn, who is five foot four. Not just a discrepancy in height, there is also a big age difference, with Jackson still in his teens at the time of the incident and Vaughn at 40 years old. There would be multiple instances of Mahomes going in for a kiss, with Vaughn appearing to push him away both times. Mahomes has not posted for his more than 1.1 million followers on TikTok since the middle of April. He would be arrested and face multiple counts of aggravated sexual battery with an additional fourth count. Here was the footage when Jackson Mahomes was taken into the police station. The footage is jarring, with Mahomes sitting in silence, uncomfortable with the cameras rolling, uncertain of his fate. His mugshot would be released by the Johnson County Sheriff's Office. Bond was set and met at the price of $100,000 with litigation pending. Mahomes has stayed rather silent. However, we have an unfortunate update to provide. The woman Mahomes kissed, Aspen Vaughn, her business is now completely ruined. According to their business's social media accounts, the establishment has closed its doors. Via the Kansas City Star, Stephanie Lopez, an administrative employee, was quoted as saying, it's hard to own a company and go through everything that we've gone through. We were so close to making it, and then this whole thing happened. They cite the harassment Vaughn suffered and death threats she heard. Vandals wrecked the restaurant as well. Aspen said business was down 75%. She claimed a criminal cut the AC unit's cords, left the gas lines inoperable, and even pulled a fire alarm, which caused the damage of tons and tons of water flooding the space. Here was the post on Facebook, on the restaurant's Facebook page. She captioned it, serious inquiries if you are interested in leasing slash buying. Some may be hopeful that the suit results in lost funds for Vaughn to restart her entrepreneurship. That followed up from a post five days prior, which read as follows, closed until further notice. The initial incident occurred back in February. Mahomes is accused of unlawfully and feloniously touching Vaughn, who simply, they claim, did not consent. They also say he unlawfully and knowingly caused physical contact with another person, done in a rude, insulting, or angry manner. Of course, that's not all. A member of Vaughn's staff, one of the, st one of the wait staff, that is, claims Jackson shoved him out of a private room he was dining in with his entourage. This after the waiter smelled weed and tried to get them to stop. The waiter alleged Jackson and his crew shoved the guy and told him to scram. Apparently Jackson frequents the establishment a lot and knows the owner's stepdaughter. Vaughn said she and her significant other kicked Jackson Mahomes and his camp out of the restaurant. In turn, they also called the police. Brandon Davies, Jackson's attorney, would tell Fox 5 his client is innocent. Our investigation has revealed substantial evidence refuting the claims of Jackson's accuser, including the statements of several witnesses, he said. We have reached out to law enforcement to provide the fruit of our investigation so that they may have a complete picture of the matter. 